Yo what up fellas, here's Benny Franco again, finally with a new video. I hope you guys doing all good in this hard corona times and stuff like that. I'm doing pretty well. In Germany everything is closed, I think like everywhere on the earth right now. So we are on the lockdown, we have many times to shot videos and stuff like that. And I have finally time to make a long time no video because I don't have time with work and all that stuff. In the corona times we have much work to do. Uh, I work at construction and there is no lockdown, we have still to work, but I'm finally on vacation, I have holiday and I start directly to make new videos for you guys. I don't know exactly what we did today, I just know that I want to make something with a nice guitar, I want to make a nice guitar melody and let's make a nice banger today. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell that you always get notified if I post a video. So let's get directly into the cook up, join me on my screen and let's get it. So, like you guys see, I worked today in an E melodic minor scale. I pulled up already the guitar, the classic nylon guitar from Omnisphere and we lay down some chords now and then we see what we come up with. So let's go. First let's keep it very simple. Let's go to E4 where it is. Let's build up some chords. Let's go on up. Nope. Could be work. Let's pull it up one octave to here a little bit better. Try out that sounds. Very low. Let's invert the chord. Sounds too similar. Exactly, nothing crazy, just simple chords. And now we will get to the sauce. I want that the guitar sounds so realistic it can be from a VST. So we copy the chords, just pull it one octave up. So we have a very full sound now. So let's stick with these and let's see what we can make now. So we'll take the bass notes and split them in half, copy them over, then it sounds like this. And the same we will make with these two. So we 
get a little bit bounce going. So now we have to experiment a little bit until we have a nice melody. So let's go over to the next one and let's put them right here. Let's see how that sounds. directly we come to a good point. <laughs> so let's take directly the next note. This, this. Let's shorten them and put them here. Let's see how that sounds. Alright, let's take the next note. First, let's take the three, because it's more easy. Shorten them again, and I think we will put it like here or here. Exactly. Hell yes. And let's take the last notes. First, the three long ones. Maybe we put it a double. It's a very nice, very simple and very nice technique to get a great guitar melody in seconds. Like you see, it, it don't take much time and it sounds pretty dope. And now you could add some notes over it as counter melody, but I want to make it with the other, uh, with the other instrument. And so let's go in. I won't try how half time sounds on it. Let's pitch everything one octave up. Right, sound stopped so far. So let's take an RC20. finish with the melody let's let's look that it sounds even more realistic alt r to randomize the velocity dope so far so let's get the drums going Also a nice trick for your hi-hats, paste them all four steps, elongate them, copy them over and lower the velocity. So it sounds a little bit more realistic. Let's lower the velocity a little bit. Never forget to tune your 808s. I know this is in the key of F, just change the key here if you want to know which key your 808 is, open the sampler menu, right click on this folder and open, oh wrong one, and open, where it is man, open an audio editor and there you can detect pitch regions and it will tell you directly which key your 808 is in. Pretty dope so far, so simple, really simple beat, but the rapper or the artist have many space to work with this beat. I just want to look now for a new layer for the main melody, 
that it sounds more full and more nice and that I have something for the hook and I want to look for a nice counter melody maybe um, with a nice plug or something so let's get it real quick let's play that real quick solo and even put the guitar out <laughs> together. channel I copy over all the effects from the first melody so we can change the velocity a little bit and let's open up one instance of Omnisphere again and let's look for a nice counter melody to get a little change up in the hook all together sound so fucking dope I just want to show you guys this crazy guitar technique to make a nice really simple really fast good guitar melody you can customize it you can make what you want i put half time on it you don't have to do it make it more simple make it more complex but i think you get the point what i want to tell you guys so let's going on i want to make a second beat with you guys my boy miller sent me over some loops he started now his ig channel i will put the link in the description that you can check him out follow him and he you see him many times on my page and now we uh, make a present for his birthday and give him a nice setup some yamaha speakers and a little keyboard and stuff like that and he want to start now to make beats and he sent me some loops so let's call up with this guy and i hear them already sounds fire so let's get it By that way, follow me in IG, I make their other videos, uh, if you enjoy my content, there are other tutorials and little videos and stuff like that. And you see once I upload a beat on BeatStars, if you want to buy a beat or rap over it or stuff like that. So let's see what he sent me, he sent me two loops, it's one uh, counter melody and one pad kind of thing in D minor 140 BPM, so let's check it out. So let's see what we can make with it. Let's search for a nice clap. It's very R&B-ish, very trap solic. Like I want to make a very ambient, very chill beat. four steps, copied it over, lowered the velocity to humanize it a little bit and now let's give it some rolls and stuff. Oh, wrong one. So 
let's get directly into the 808. Let's give it the right key. It's my go-to 808. This 808 sounds on every beat fire. And even it's a little bit dark here, let's give some nice lights. Hell yeah. almost the drums go a little bit more crazy with the open head let's give it an envelope that we can play it so long as we uh, like we want and even I will make a pitch like that give it a track lower the velocity a little bit and now it's got a little bit more crazy Light. Let's see how it sounds. I would say it sounds dope. So let's copy it over. Very nice loops. Nice that you sent it to me. Thank you. It's really dope. So the beat came out pretty good, pretty nice, I really like it. Let me know in the comments if you like this beat and which beat you like more, what I did today. I will mix the beat real quick and give it a nice arrangement and let, let it play at the end that you guys can hear what we did so far. So guys, that's pretty much the video of today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Shout out to Miller to send me this nice loops. Here is his IG, give him a follow, he will start soon to make his own shit and you will see many things more with us too so i hope you enjoyed this video if yes leave a like subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell that you always get notified if i post something i will increase by posting very much i will go crazy now i will make many nice stuff you will see it in the future so stay healthy guys i will see you soon follow my ig follow my twitter have a nice day thanks for watching peace